Let's take a look at this week's college football rankings brought to you by Goodyear. For the first time this season, AP voters offer teams other than Clemson and Bama a little love. Georgia gets four first place votes and Ohio State gets seven of them, gentlemen. It's time to discuss the Capital One fan vote. Again, four teams get first place votes this week. That's the first time that's happened this season. And so I ask you, David Pollock, who is your number one team in the land? The Ohio State Buckeyes. Wow. I, I, I have seen enough from them on their defensive line with Chase Young and company that I know they're elite. I think their cornerbacks are elite. I love what they've done defensively and restructuring. And then let's be honest. Like, we know they're going to get up to quarterback. We know they're going to create turnovers defensively. Justin Fields in this offense can attack you in multiple ways. You can tell he's growing and he's going to continue to grow throughout the season. So, I think the Buckeyes, for what they've done so far, just destroying every single person in the way, uh, is the number one team in the country. I'm going to stick with Clemson. And, I, and I've done this year after Whoa. year, Dave. We've been at it for a while. Uh, the, the defending national champion always stays number one with me until somebody beats them. And so it seems that whoever wins a championship that next season, they just don't play up the par. So I go through this a lot because I continually keep that team at number one until they lose. And believe me, Clemson, uh, they've shown some cracks in the armor, and, but they've won football games. At the, in the end of the day, the goal is to remain undefeated and the defending champion is still undefeated, they will be number one for me until that's no longer the case. I mean, what kind of philosophy is that? That's not the best team in the country. You don't just automatically be the best team in the country because you were last year. Yeah. Oh, it, it's been my philosophy since you've known me, David. I'm and not going to change wrong. it now. It's been wrong, so you need to change it. Uh, that could be the case. I, I'm not doubting <laughs> that it's right or wrong. I'm just saying it's my philosophy. <laughs> All right. If fine. you guys want to check out the Capital One fan vote, participate yourself, go to twitter.com backslash sports center. Now, there are probably 10 or so teams who are still alive in the broader scope. Four of them are going to make the show. So we're in October now, so we can go ahead and start deciding who might be our first out. Joey Galloway, who's number five for you? Who's your first team out right now? Today, number five for me is Ohio State, and, and that's – you know, that won't Dang. hold serve because so many of these teams have to play each other. And the reason they're first out, it, it's real simple for me. Clemson's number one. Uh, Alabama coming at number two. And then LSU and Georgia both have top ten wins. And so I really like what the Buckeyes are doing right now. I need to see them play somebody just as I need to see Alabama play somebody. The rest of these teams have played someone. And so – as solid as Ohio State has looked and as solid as Alabama looks in football, you can't tell what someone's weakness is until they play a team that can expose that weakness, and really neither team has. Yeah, I, I mean, I, I hear you, um, but that, my first team out would be Clemson. Because, um, again, <laughs> I'm going to take – I'm, I'm going to take what I've seen this season, guys, and, I, and this isn't a perfect science, and just like Joey talked about, I'm taking what I've seen this season, what you've done on the field against really good competition. If you haven't played good competition, how you've looked, a la North Carolina. Um, to me, if I start going through the top of the list with Ohio State and Georgia and LSU, I'm more impressed with what they've done and impressed with their resume and how they've handled people than I am with Clemson. It doesn't mean that Clemson's a bad team, and Clemson's this is all going to work itself out. But right now, I would have Clemson at number five. We're so glad you're watching ESPN on YouTube. For more sports and analysis, download the ESPN app. And for live streaming sports and premium content, make sure you subscribe to ESPN+. Plus. We'll see you there.